What's up team, rise and shine. It is early in the morning right now, just setting up for my first client of the day. I'm gonna be doing some boxing stuff. Looking forward to that, should wake me up. Um, yeah, here we go again. guys uh, morning clients complete got my massage in uh, had a training client first thing there great way to wake up have somebody throwing punches at you hitting the pads that kind of thing um, from here now I'm gonna get a coffee I got a little bit of time to do some computer work and then it's off to the clinic for a full day of massages again um, just thinking back to last night you know spending time walking around the downtown core of the city, you see lots and lots of different types of people. Um, and first of all, I find it fascinating just seeing all the different types of people, uh, the different lifestyles. Um, but really, it, it brings me back to just so much gratitude, being so grateful for the life that I have been given and the life that I've worked for. And you just, you see, for example, so many people who are walking the streets homeless and regardless of what you think of what their situation might have been, choices that they might have made to get there, whatever it might be, just looking at my own life and realizing how grateful I am that, uh, that I was put in a position that, that I could live a life that I wanted to live and make make the right choices that I wanted to make it's just it, it just thinking about it again just fills me with gratitude which is a good feeling but um yeah it's just just looking around and seeing what you have and what's what some other people don't have can be extremely eye-opening um yeah um like I said, gonna grab a coffee here, hit some computer work, and then I'll be off to the clinic. Hey guys, I finished my lunch. Uh, I got some time still, so now I'm gonna be hitting some computer work here. Uh, I'm just typing up some stuff. 
and uh, yeah, just getting it. Finished up for the day here with at the clinic. I gotta get some gas in my car and then head home. Helping Melissa train with one of her friends tonight. Should be good. Let's see if we can get some footage of that for you guys. See you there. Their workout. How are you guys feeling? Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Tired. <laughs> Alright, guys. So, we went to bed late last night. I didn't get to close off the vlog. Um, watched a movie, Fast 8. It was pretty good. Uh, but one thing I wanted to talk about yesterday that I didn't get a chance to was expanding on being in control. And what I mean by that is. I talked about how you should always be in control, you're in control of your decisions, but there's another side to that that I didn't talk about at the time, and that's that there are things in life that we can't control, and I think sometimes we spend too much time worrying about the things that we can't control. So like, things that have already happened, genetics, an example of this is obesity. Now with obesity there are people who are born with certain conditions or diseases, whatever, that make them more prone to obesity. But they're still in control. They can still take control and make work towards it instead of letting that control them, if that makes sense. So it's easy to say, oh, obesity runs in my family, so I'm going to be obese. But you can take actions to counter that as much as you possibly can. Um, same thing, like, we worry about something that has already happened, and then we stress about it. That's something we can't control, so focus on the things that you can control. You can control not letting that thing happen again, or doing things that will decrease the chance of whatever that was happening again. Um, so yeah, trying to figure out the things that you can control and things that you can't control and focusing all your energy on the things that you can control and not the things that have already happened or where you just you have absolutely no control over just it's just a waste of time really um, gonna start 
today's vlog now. Um, yeah, see ya. Subscribe, hit the like button. See you later.